We are the designated unit at the moment for the Ebola patients, and we are eager to take care of these patients. That's what we do. But the goal is everybody gets out alive, and we're not sure that standard has been met. I would like to make sure that we not only have the equipment that keeps us completely impervious to any um, exchange of body fluids, but we also have to protect our colleagues, the patients next door, the, the visitors in the ICU, our families, and really the community. We feel unsafe and unprotected. The equipment that is provided, um, the goggles or the, the face shield is flimsy. There's an open area where there's potential for huge exposure to the face. Okay. Um, and even the preparedness is really lacked. There's been no real nurse, bedside nurse involvement in how this is prepared when we're going to be the ones taking care of these patients. Sure. It's scary. And yeah. um, there's no pla plan in place for the potential of mass nurses, you know, being on quarantine leave. Okay. You know, as it is, uh, we're working, many nurses are working overtime. There was a mandatory overtime last night at the hospital because nurses, there weren't enough nurses or even places to put patients. And so even now, um, if nurses go out on extended sick leave, who's going to replace them?